what's up, it's your boy Cranes here, bringing you how to use and download Schematica. Hopefully you guys do enjoy, remember to lick that like button, subscribe if you're new. As you guys can see, I was just building a sort of a base for another map or something. I wasn't really complete, I was going to do this on those sides, or actually no I wasn't. I think this is how I was going to do it, just leave it like this and then put sand in there. But anyway guys, this is um something that you guys have been asking for for a while, in my good old... Uh, my how to build auto brewers, which here the auto brewers over here. I'll be putting the schematica in the description below and all the downloads you need. Pretty much, yeah. People have been, oh, can I have the schematica? I'm having difficulties doing this and stuff like that. But yeah, so I'm going to teach you guys. So if you guys can remember, this is one of my maps from a while ago, and this was a um, uh, basis, sorry. And this is one of my fails or fail attempt of making um, walls or whatever they're called, um, regen walls or whatever. And this was something else I was gonna do, put that on top of here, which was gonna be a pretty cool idea, but I just decided not to. I remember map 23 or something, we had that as part of the base. So anyway, guys, I don't know what that is. I think that's an auto melon thing, maybe? Let me have a look, um, melon. But anyway, guys, I'm just gonna quickly go like this. I'll be very, whoa, that was trippy. Yeah, it's an auto melon. All right, sweet. All right, anyway, guys, I'm gonna teach you guys how to do it. Let's try and get like, I don't know, about 50 likes or something, and I'll keep doing some more. I'm gonna teach you guys how to make fence gates, traps, like stuff over here that I've been using or working on like so I think it works. Oh shit. Yeah, there we go like so and Yeah, I was just using this and practicing doing other stuff like staircases, but anyway guys, please enjoy the video so pretty much this is what I like to do with my controls I go to controls and I Do this we got load schematica. So you've got load schematica I press the on the number pad I press the one which for some reason comes up with n End, and then I'll um, manipulate schematica I do number two on the number pad and then save schematica number three so you don't need these two in my opinion I don't really like using them I just like doing it without like yeah just seeing the whole thing so you can use those if you want just for this tutorial put them as those numbers but when you actually like you can change them in the future but just for this please do it so pretty much this is where you um, when you've saved your schematic this is where you get all the schematic you've got like I'll show you one let's just go Leon Archer we'll go Leon Archer so that's what the Leon Archer looks like these are very handy in building bases for HCF or building cannons etc so let me just uh, hide this but here this is uh, I'm gonna teach you guys how to do firstly you press your three button and you pretty much locate whereabouts you're gonna have everything or like what you want to save etc so I'm gonna put it right on this corner. So it's gonna be saving this area. Now you have to go to the other side of the area, like so. And bam. So we're gonna put it here. Then we're gonna do blue point. I'm gonna move it in one so I don't have to have the rest. So like that. All right, if you guys have noticed, I haven't put the Y up, which you definitely have to do. Because if you do not put the Y up, it's only gonna be copying the first um, line of all the first blocks so that if that makes any sense so pretty much on one of the sides it doesn't matter which side have one go all the way up to the very top of however tall your thing is so i'm going to put it about there guys i think that's no nah, i might put it a little bit more like so so pretty much now guys you're going to write in what you want so i'm going to do testing um testing yeah just testing so then you go to save like so so i've saved that okay it says starting saving 20 chunks into testing schematic now we go over here Let's just say that you want to do it on your faction world. You can do it. It doesn't... I don't think you get banned for it unless you do put on printer, which auto places for you, which do not do it. You're going to get yourself permanently banned off any server. So this is what you guys do. So you've got it here. Testing, as you guys can see. You click it. Bam. And you've got yourself your schematic. So now to do it, you guys already know what to do. Let's just get a block to show you guys. I'm pretty sure this is the block. You just pretty much place like so and for some reason it does that as occasionally pretty much if it goes orange like that it means it's the wrong block or I think yeah it's it's like no that's red red's the wrong block but it's like a block uh, let's, let's figure it out all right so I'm just gonna go from the top of my head sorry that didn't really make any sense so as you guys can see the, the block is purple right now that means there shouldn't be a block there and now let's go this so next thing is as you guys can see it's gone red that means it's not meant to like it's not meant to be there, it's a different colour it's meant to be. So now this is another example of what I mean by the other the other part. So let's just say, I think it's Stone Brick Monster Egg. So as you guys can see, oh that's red, oopsies. So let's have a look. Uh, look for some wood maybe. But pretty much the orange means that it should be a different way or let's just say that the, the schematic is like this, okay? But I'm placing the block like that. It means it'll go orange saying you've put it the wrong way. So then, 
yeah, it's a little confusing, but you guys will get the hang of it after a while. But, yeah, anyway, guys, I'm going to be putting the media fire and stuff down in the description below. I Hopefully, this did help you guys. You can do it for pretty much anything. But once you've got one schematica on, once you've set up another one, like, so, let's just say, giraffe. The other one will clear. So, just be careful with um, what you're doing so you don't get rid of it. But also, I nearly forgot. So, I'm just going to pop up this again, guys, quickly. And we'll just do Kanga base. So, this is a base that I was going to be building map 12, but we didn't have enough space for it. Pretty much, let's just say you want to move it, you go to your number two, okay? This is where you guys can move it side to side. Yeah, so, however you want to fit it. You can put it up, down, etc. Or I should do down, up. And then maybe forward, backwards. So, yeah, hopefully this has helped you guys. And you can change your the controls in the future if you guys want to. But just for this tutorial, please just do that. It'll make life so much easier. But anyway, guys, without further ado, hopefully this did help you guys. The download to everything will be in the link below. Just put it in your mods folder, and then everything will be done from there. Also, I will be putting the media fire download or media fire yeah fire download to the auto brewers, which I can show you here. Um, best auto brewers as like as so. So I'm gonna be putting this down in the description below the download to this. So pretty much if you want to drag this in, you'll pretty much have something like this, which I'm going to be putting back. So I'll quickly cut back and I'll show you. BRB. All right, boys, I'm back and I'm heading over to run to show you guys the mods, etc. So we're going to be hitting it up, dot Minecraft, and then we'll go to mods. So as you guys can see, you guys must have like mods and stuff. So pretty much this is what you guys need. Before you guys say, oh, hacks, hacks, this is pretty much um helps with my lag. So it's um, something that Purple's brought out. So hopefully I don't get banned for that. I'm pretty sure it's illegal. It's been all over Reddit. And it's not like a hack client or anything. But anyway, guys, this is, these are the um, things or the mods you guys will need. You need the Schematica 1.7.10, 1.7.6. You guys can get 1.8 if you guys play on 1.8 servers, but I won't be putting that in the downloads. I'll only be putting 1.7. Also, guys, you need the Lunar Trius Core. My apologies if I didn't say that right. But you need both of these, and then Schematica will be able to work. And with the thing I was saying, the resource, not the resource, the Schematica of Best Order Brewers, I'm going to be putting this in the um in the description below so pretty much when you put your mods in this will not come up until you've made your own schematica so i would advise you guys to quickly make a schematica as i showed you guys by like opening saving and then once you've saved one you'll be able to go into your dot minecraft and there'll be a schematics folder when there's a schematics folder that's when you can get the best auto brewers schematic and then just drag it in to schematics okay and then next time you hop on you can just do one and it'll be there but anyway, guys, hopefully you guys did enjoy the video. If so, remember to lick that like button, subscribe if you're new. Thank you guys for 3.6k subs. We actually gained about, I think, um, I don't even know, like 110 subs in about six days, which is absolutely crazy. Thanks so much, guys. Hopefully we can hit 4k soon. And more trapping videos will be out very soon. If you guys didn't know already, I am joining Hackersate's faction for map 13. So if that's all good, I'm pretty sure I am. If not, oh well. But yeah, I'm 100% sure I am. But anyway... Please enjoy, guys, or please, hopefully you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.